Queen, guys. Okay. We need the towel. Okay. Lagyan po natin siya ng towel here. Okay. Then, I don't know. Unconscious. Unconscious ko. Or any independent patient. Kasi ang patient naman, ah, sorry, independent patient. Any independent patient naman, okay, pagpaliligon mo, dadalig mo sa banyo. Kung di siya nakakalakad, pero kaya niya naman maligo mag-isa, lagay mo lang siya sa uh, commode chair. Okay, ito mo, siya na yung maliligo. So yan, unconscious. This is either unconscious or paralyzed. Okay? <coughs> so lalagyan ko siya dito ng ano, support. And bago kayo pala magpaligo, ah, make sure na yung patient nyo, kasi may mga patient na may fracture pala dito. Okay, hindi mo pwedeng gawin to. Tapos yung patient na may vertigo, okay, hindi mo rin pwedeng gawin to. Kasi na yung hilo yan pag ginagalaw-galaw mo. So kaya kayo nag-check na medical or order to check if it's indicated for the patient to do such procedure. Okay? Then, paglagay po kayo nito, may gano'n eh, may butas dito para pag nagpaligo ka, lalabas tapos may diretsyo siya na parang balde tapos yung leeg po, nakaano yan nakalimutan ko, nagkakalimutan ko nagkakalimutan ko, nagkakalimutan ko nagkakalimutan ko, nagkakalimutan ko parang sa salon may gano'n sa hospital pero yung dito niya, parang rubber then may timba na kasahon so medyo naka nakaangat po talaga yung ulo niya yung ano niya connect siya ng bed Ha? Parang ilalagay mo sa unahan ng bed. Oo. Oh, oh. Ganito din siya. Tapos may connect, nakakonect siya ng <laughs> may host timba. Mm -hmm. Pero may iba yung katulad sa video, no? Yung ilalagay siya. Oo, oh, oh, iba naman yung sa video. Okay. Ito yung ano, yung ano, yung ano, yung ano. Okay. So, sa shampooing, kailangan natin ng, uh, ayun, shampoo board. Shampoo board. Ang tag dito, shampoo board. Tapos, lagyan nyo siya nito. Then, I need the shampoo. small towel. Shampoo. Small towel. Okay. So, i-cover natin yung akal niya. Mata. Uh, face, kasi baka malagyan. Di ba? Mahilang. Then, I need the shampoo. Ito, ito, ito. Okay. So, for shampoo, we, we need shampoo. We need conditioner. Okay. We need the comb. We need the hair blower. Okay? So, let's start. So, you need the basin also and the... Okay. Dapat may bucket tayo. Kunyari, ito yung bucket natin and ito yung basin. So, yung bucket natin, i-fill natin siya ng warm water. Okay? Make sure na yung room bed is warm. Okay? Para hindi lamigin si patient. Okay, walang nakabukas na windows and doors. Okay, so ilagay natin siya sa basin. I-check natin yung temperature by using our inside dress. Okay, inside dress. Bakit itong inside dress? Bakit hindi ito or what? This is sensitive to heat. Okay, pwede rin ito. Sensitive din to sa heat. Okay, di ba pag nagpapasuso kayo ng anak nyo? Yes. Hindi nyo nilalagay para ma-ano yung, uh, ma-check nyo yung init. Okay. Then, we need the, the tabo. Okay, so first is rinse the hair. Okay? So, while rinsing the hair, massage it and assess it also. If there is any infestation or infection, lice or whatsoever, wounds or bed sore here. Sometimes, there will be bed sore here, no? So, rinse. Then, put shampoo. Then, massage. Massage. Okay. Then, rinse. Rinse. Okay. So, kung gusto ng patient mag-conditioner at tanggal yung hair niya, pwede nyo siyang magbigay ng conditioner. Okay. 
mostly sa mga patient na lalaki, di ba, hindi naman nila prefer. Mm. Kaya optional ang conditioner. Okay? So, gusto ni Mr. David to say, <laughs> Then after rinsing, if you're already finished, make sure that there's no soap or uh, whatsoever shampoo na natira kasi minsan nakakamadali natin kaya nagkakadandraf yung patient kasi hindi natin nililinis ng buke or nirinse. So make sure you rinse it thoroughly, okay? Then remove this. Okay, it should be from 
yes, to her yes. Okay? Hindi so, naman kayo naliligo na nag-start muna kayo sa pepe nyo, then ang buha nyo, tama? Apo, ano? Ano? Okay? So, hindi tayo, hindi natin gagawin din yung pasyente. Kung so, ano ginagawa nyo, kung so, ano ginagawa nyo sa sarili nyo, gano'n hindi gagawin natin Apo. sa pasyente. Okay? So, hindi naman kayo nagugus mo na ng puwet, then yung buha sa, sa muka. <laughs> hindi gano'n. So, from cleanest to the ideas. Okay, let's start. Let's start with the face. Okay, let's make a meat. Okay, in making a meat, Okay, you need to pull. Okay. This is making a meat. Okay, dapat ano? Ulik na. Ganito lang yun ano yun. Okay. Shoot. Parang topi ng panty. This is how you make a meat. Okay? Then, you need to wipe the eyes first, the inner tattoos, and then wipe again with a separate section of the floor. Okay? That is rinse. Okay? Then, change. Kabila naman. Inner. So, outer. Okay? Then, tapos na tayong i-rinse. Then, it is. Lagay natin dito. Then, dry. Okay? Next is wash, rinse, dry of the face, neck, and the ear. Okay? So, face, wash, then neck, wash, then ears, Ah, then okay. Rinse. Then rinse. Face. Neck. 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 Ears. 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 Okay. Then don't forget to dry. 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 And blower. 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 Okay, so tapos ka na dyan, now we'll do the shaving. Kasi bawat parts na may ginagawa, gagawin na natin para save time. Okay? Now we'll go with the shaving. Okay, anong anong mga guidelines natin pag i-shave tayo ng patient? Electronic. Electronic. Okay. Meron tayong pinatawag na electric and meron tayong pinatawag na disposable. Disposable shaver. Okay, pag disposable shaver, ito. Pero, preferably, we are using that. Electric shaver, kasi ito control yung sharp niya. Okay, kaya less yung bleeding ng patient. Compare dito, madalas mag-bleed ang patient. Okay? Okay, kung ang tubo ng mukha, ng pababa, ng buhok pa ganito, paano yun? Pababa din po. Pababa din. Okay. So first, guys, is, ano natin, moisten natin to. Warm water, ibabad natin sa warm water, and then i-moisten natin yung part na i-shave natin. Okay? So, after that is, kung gusto niya ng cream, shaving cream, o pwede mo siyang ilagay, one-fourth inch ng face. Okay? Then, open it, and then shave. Hold the skin to, okay, and then with a long stroke. Sira na kasi kung ano yun. Oh, very good, very good. Sira. Imagination. Okay, paano pag dumugo? Press. Ten. Put pressure. Okay, you can put pressure from this one or both. Okay, and then don't forget to inform the nursing in charge. Why? Kasi yung mga patient pag nagdugo baka may side effects yun ng ano, ng iniinom nilang gamot mm. like anti-coagulant or aspirin or anti-platelets mm -mm. kaya dapat i-report nyo yun okay? then after that so towards the skin uh, the hair growth and mm. then rinse it with water okay? then kung gusto niya ng lotion or after shave, maglagay po kayo ng after shave. Okay? After shave. Then, ano pa? Finish. That is how you will shave the patient. Okay? Baka sabihin nyo, ma'am, ba hindi naman natin gagamitin yan? 
madalas ako nagsishave sa ospital. Lalo ng mga matagal ng pasyente. Kahit nga gumit, nagugupit ako sa pasyente. Magiging barbero ako. Okay? Pag ang haba-haba na ng ano mga pasyente, at ang baho-baho na ng pasyente galit sa, ano, sa buhok. Okay? Ginugupitan namin yung moho. Parang mga gawa ko moho. Nakita na po siya, what is this? <laughs> Sabi mo, gupit ang kita. Tapos pag nakita niya yung buhok, ano akong ganito yung buhok ko? May, may iba dito. <laughs> eh, sabi mo, gupitan kita eh. Anyways, gagawin niyo talaga yan. Okay? Yun yung ano lang doon. Kasi magbabat na tayo ng, ng remaining ano, body. So we'll do the undressing of the gown. So where, where we will start? The strong ones. The good side. So, pan ba na kita sa sabi ang good side and bad side? Without ng 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 So, we'll start with the, okay, lagyan natin siya na bath blanket. Okay, tanggalin mo na ito, Beth. Yan. Then, remove from here. To fit the part of it. Remove the part of it. Ano, bali yung kawin. Sorry, Mr. Dove. Okay. So, kailangan unahin muna natin yung IV ipasok bago yung kamay. Okay? Yung iba kasi nalilito pag bago eh. Yung kamay. Nagkaikot-ikot na yung IV. Unahin mo muna kasi ipasok yung IV. Okay? IV muna guys. Yes. Di ba? Kung, kung ang mga anak nyo na-confine na dati, malalaman nyo po siya. And don't forget, lagi, pag ginagalo nyo ang IV, laging nakapilagos. Okay? Para hindi mag-backflow. Okay, pakitiklo po ito. Gamitin mo natin mamaya. Okay, then, ilagay. You're not allowed to, ah, ang tag dito, ibalik yung flow rate nito. So, you call the nurse to on. Nag-close ka lang. Yes, nag-close ka lang. Hindi ka pwede mag-ano. Kasi meron niyang flow rate. The gripping factor, gripping rate, na hindi mo kaya. Okay, na hindi mo under ng ano mo, prescription mo. Nurse lang po yun. Okay? Ano din siya, di ba, under medication? Yes, under medication. This is medication. Okay. So, next. After shaving, we address the gown, then we need to bath the parts. Anong mga parts na? Arms. 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 Okay, first is the arms. Okay. Ang tanong ng iba, ma'am, paano ko i-dress, ah, uh, i-bait yung arms? So, unahin ko to, then ito, then legs, then legs. No. Lahat ng parts na pwede mo magawa dito, gawin, gawin mo na. Gawin mo na. Oh, kasi bago ka lumipad sa kabila, to conserve your energy. Imagine yourself, you might be doing this for 10 patients, and hindi <laughs> mo alam kung saan ka. Okay, you need to conserve your energy, no? Imagine you will be doing it for 12 hours. Imagine yourself, you will be so tired. Okay, so, you manage your time, you manage your effort, or you conserve your energy. Okay? Lagay natin to dito, guys. Lengthwise sa arms. Bakit? Kasi ito yung mag- Mag-dry. Mag-dry later. Okay. And, draw an imaginary line. Okay, i-cut nyo tong arms and legs into three. So, from hands to elbow, elbow to shoulder, shoulder to arm. Okay? Then, wash Rinse and dry. Okay. Wash. Wash. Then rinse. Wash. Ah, sorry. Rinse. Rinse. And then dry. Okay. So, ngayon, tapos nyo na siya nahugasan, pwede na po kayong mag-nail hair. Okay, nail hair. Saan nga ba? Dapat ako. Yeah. Okay. Sa nail hair po, we need soak the fingers. Okay, don't soak fingers of patient with diabetes. Okay. 
Okay, meron naman tayong towel dito para hindi mabasa yung ano, whatever itself. Okay, batting of face, neck, and ears. Okay? So, we need to... Basin. Basin. Give me another basin. We need two basin. And we need... Ano ba kami tapos? Ano ba tapos? Ano ba tapos? Ano ba tapos? We need two... We need, we need two basin and we need two towels. Face towels. Where is that? Ah, sa isa kong towel. Isa kong towel. Okay. So, one basin is for washing. Pag sinabi mong washing, with soap and water. Uulitin ko. Pag sinabi mong washing, soap and water. Ganina, may isang studyante, nasa perennial care na kami, tinanong niya ako, mag ano yan? May ano ba yan? May sabun ba yan? Eh, di ko sinabi ko. Simula una pa lang. Okay, kaya inuulit ko, this is for washing. So, it means na mayroon tong sabon. Yung isa, rinsing. Mayroon tong wala tong sabon. Tubig lang. Ang guidelines natin, if it's like a pusher. Pusher, pero ito hindi ito nakakasugat. Okay? Kaya, okay siya. Disposable din po siya. Okay? So, pag nasoon niya na, 2 to 3 minutes, Okay, now, we'll remove the dirt. Remove the dirt. Okay. Then, brush. Brush. Then, we'll take the towel. Cut sa straight lang. Bawal mag-cut sa gilid. Kung tayo gusto-gusto natin magpa-pedicure ng kinatanggal yung ating mga ingro, hindi po pwede sa pasyente. Baka tanongan mo Cut lang. Especially diabetic patient. Diabetic patient, very sensitive yan. Mabilis magkasugat. Okay? Lalaki yan ng lalaki. Pag nasugatan nyo, lalaki siya ng lalaki. Eh, hindi yun allowed talaga po. Pumunta kayo sa Canada or sa ibang bansa, hindi yun allowed. Ang, ang mga manicurista doon, yung mayaman, na hindi napapagod. Okay. Bakit? Kasi cut-cut lang sila, konting linis lang, tapos nabayad na, binabayaran na sila. Kasi nga, hindi allow doon na magkutkot, katulad sa atin. Gusto mo sa natin kinukutkot yung mga dumi. Ano natin, di ba? So, natin dumudugo pa. Sa kanila, hindi pwede. Okay? So, cut it straight. Straight, 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 straight. Okay? Then, nail file. Then, nail file po natin. food na yung ano nito, kamina ko pa ina. <laughs> And then, lotion. Okay. Sa finishing touch natin. Okay, masahihin natin. Kamay lang. Ito lang. Kaya nga nail care lang eh. Okay. So, tapos na tayo sa nail care. Okay. Now, we'll go to the next part which is the chest. Okay, chest. So, you remove this one. You put it here, horizontally. Then, ibaba mo yung iyong back blanket. Okay. Six pack siya na. Mr. David. Hello. Hi. Then, wash, rinse, and dry. Okay? Tataas ko lang para makita nyo, ha? Sabi ng studyante kanina, nakataas po talaga. Okay, wash. Rinse. Kung ang patient mo, babae, at malaki ang suso, isalain mo. Okay? Or sa mga attention sa suso. Sa ilalim. Susin. Susin. Kasi may mga libag dyan, di ba? Then, dry. Okay? Then, go down to the abdomen. Pay particular attention to the umbilicus or the umbilical cord. Ano yan? Buso. Ah, this is stoma. Later, I'll explain. This is stoma. Stoma. Ito yung ano, yung pag may cancer ka, dyan siya tumatae. Ay, nilalagyan po ng parang tubo dyan. Ah. Okay. Ito yung ano, yung pag may cancer ka, dyan siya tumatae. Ah, okay. Ito yung ano, yung pag may cancer ka, dyan siya tumatae. Ah, okay. Ito yung ano, yung pag may cancer ka, dyan siya tumatae. Kaya meron kang nilalagyan yung tumbag. Pag may cancer ka na, gano'n. Oh, may yan. So, after that, wash this and dry. Okay? Next. 
Babad nyo siya up to 2 to 3 minutes, guys. Okay. Okay, then, dinisin yung mga in-between. Kasi dyan yung dumi at saka yung athlete's foot dyan nagde-develop. Okay, makikita yung mga patient ang babago ng taa. O, oh, kasi, nandyan yung athlete's foot. <laughs> then, yung athlete's foot. Okay? Then, remove. Then, yung katun yung trabaho natin. Okay? Okay? Lalo sa home care, pag mm-hmm. nagkakaw sa home care, good luck. Sana makapasok kayo sa mga hospital talaga. Sana yung alam ko sa home care. Ayun. Asa mo yung akong day care? Ako nila kaya. Ako lang. Duling. Okay, pwede nyo rin lagay kayo ng uh, uh, underpads dito, pero meron naman akong towel. Oh, towel. Okay. So, it's okay. Okay. So, same procedure. Orange. Okay, orange stick. Remove the dirt. Okay, then? Brush. Brush. Wash, wash, wash. Then, cut straight. And file. Lastly, lotion. lotion. And massage. Massage the food. Okay, then done. Okay, next. Other side. Last yan. Other side. Go to the other side. But you will not do it in them. But you should, ah, baka sa tukong buhay. Okay, other side ba na. Okay, ang sa other side, ang gagawin nyo na lang, parehas. Okay, at legs na lang. Sabi nung dati kong studyante, ma'am, di ba kalahati din ang patches? Hello, sir. Okay, oh, ginawa ko na yun. <laughs> Amot mo naman. Sabi yung mga studyante sometimes, eh, hindi ko maaintindihan. Okay, now, tapos na tayo sa kabilang side. Let's go back. Uh, let's go now to the back side. Okay, huwag nyo kalimutan, hinilisin pa rin natin ang ah. liko. Diba? Okay, now we'll place our patient. Okay, same procedure. Okay, lagay natin siya doon. Okay. Get that, ano, kunyari nilagay na natin, lagay natin doon, catheter, remove here, clamp the catheter, clamp. Yes, then put the catheter there, and then remove Mr. David from this part. Lang po hindi Mr. David, ay blood po siya. Ito talaga, ay blood po siya. Kunyari nandito yung IV ha. Okay, Mr. David. Well, you clean your back. So, that's an isang towel ko. Okay, cover the, this one. Only expose the stock part. Okay? Now. Same procedure. Same procedure. Wash, wash, wash. Same procedure. Wash. Okay? Rinse. And then, dry. Ang dry nyo pala, top lang, hindi pwede dry pala lang. Kasi nagka-crate kayo ng friction. Okay? Top lang. Okay. Next is back care. 
Okay, we have four types of back massage, right? Yes. Back massage. Okay. We have the effleurage, petrissage, petrissage, and deflexion. Okay, kanino mo hindi pa din gawin ang back massage? Okay, fracture, okay, burn, 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 Pain level, sa tanungin natin siya, from 0 to 10, 0 being the low, no pain, mm -hmm. 10 being the highest pain. Okay, highest degree of pain. Okay, what is your pain score <coughs> right now? Okay, bakit ba natin tinatanong? Para alam mo yung alam enough mo yung pressure last. na kailangan mo yes. i-apply. And you will know also if your uh, massage will be effective afterwards. Kasi nga, i-reassess mo ulit siya later. Okay? So now... We'll do the effluvage. Okay. Effluvage, you're using your palm. Okay, palm. And then, gliding movement. Okay? Pwede dito muna kayo mag-start, then pwede dito din. Okay? Hard medium or hard massage. So, this is effluvage. Now, petrissage. Petrissage is... You're kneading. You're using this part. Okay. Using the pressure. Knead. Okay. The boat mat. Tapping. Pwede rin ganito. That is the boat mat. Pwede rin ganito. The boat mat na yan. Okay. As long as you're tapping it, that's the boat mat. Okay. Then lastly is your deep friction. Deep friction is using your thumb. Twist. Okay? Kaya siya di dapat malalim. Okay, malalim siya. Sa pagkutang. Okay. Ay, Juanis, kailangan ka talaga tumihan. Okay? Hindi na maya. Okay, buttocks. Go. Buttocks, no? Hindi ba? Nandito lang. Yes. Okay? Then after that is... Lotion. Remove the excess lotion. Okay? Okay. Remove the excess lotion. And then reassess or evaluate now the pain scale of the patient. Mr. David, sabi niya kanina 6 over 10. Uh, how how much is your pain score uh, right now? Sabi niya 3. Ibig sabihin, bumaba. Ibig sabihin, effective ka. Okay, nakatulong yung back position. Pag sinabi niya 10, lalo sa back position. Okay, now, uh, catheter please. Naku, hindi niyo pala in-open. <laughs> Nabalik na yung ihi. <laughs> Bumalik.